All right, everybody, welcome back. Thank you so much for stopping by, I appreciate it. Today, I'm gonna be going over the insulated eight in one screwdriver and uh, just gonna open it up, tell you guys what it's all about and uh, give you guys an example of how it works. Let's jump in. All right, so here is the package for the eight in one insulated screwdriver. It is rated for a thousand volts. And you can see right here, there are five different tips. Um, three of these are reversible with double-sided. Two of these are singular. And there are two Phillips uh, right here, two quarter inch slot, and then a Phillips number one, 316 slot, and then a square one and square two. And you can get this for $50 um, at most retailers, uh, Home Depot or Amazon. And then you can get this screwdriver with just this one double-sided Phillips number two and quarter inch slot for $20. Uh, two in one, single reversible for $20. Um, I got the one with four more options right here, and it also comes with a carrying case, which I will open here in a second. So let's go ahead and open her up. After completely destroying the package, you can see here, ooh, very cute. Right here you have the Klein Tools carrying case, Velcro, ooh, my favorite snack, save that for later. Um, and then you have the spot to hold it, and then all the tip holders right here. I'm not sure what those exactly do, probably protect the tips. And then nice little folding right there. So you have the handle, which looks very nice, feels really good, same as always. Um, I don't know if it says made in USA, so if you're one of those people, then maybe stay clear of this. Um, if it's not American made, if you're anti-America. Anyways, um, I'm not sure what that's about. Um, anyways, jumping right in, these are kind of feel nice and heavy. Um, as you can hear that the metal tips right there, but this also feels like kind of metal on the inside. Um, but we'll go ahead and test that out later to double check that. So starting out, you're just going to push it in and it locks into place very nice. Not really any wiggle at all. And then, whoa, sheesh. You can go ahead and twist that to unlock it and that'll pop right out. So it works really nice. You can go to the right or to the left, um, so that's cool. Um, so as you can see, when you use the reversibles, you have about maybe five or six inches right here. If you use the longer bits, they're gonna be about twice as long, um, or maybe a little bit longer, maybe just a couple extra inches. But anyways, um, these are gonna stick out a lot further just because they're not reversible. Um, so if you're looking to get into a panel or something um, and you want some extra room, these, these would be the ones to use. Um, so these are very cool. And this would, I think, would be a great daily tool um, if you're working on stuff live or anything like that, which you shouldn't be, but if you do, um, regardless, this is still a great tool that you could use as a daily, um, even if you just wanted to carry as like a two-in-one um, just for your daily stuff for your Phillips and your slotted. I think it would be a pretty sweet option just to be able to flip it around real quick. Um, if you're a person like me that probably doesn't want to do that, then Go ahead and carry two different screwdrivers in your tool bag. All right, so starting out, I'm just gonna use a screwdriver to take off this faceplate. I don't want to go over to my panel and um, take apart my panel to show you this, so I'm just going to test it out on this receptacle here. Um, and what I am wondering personally, the shaft will show up on a, a voltage tester if it will show up, but um, we're gonna test this out and see um, if the power is totally insulated, which is what this is made for. I'm just gonna give you guys a real life demo here. Obviously it should work or they wouldn't sell it, but we're gonna go ahead and check it out. As you can see, got our hot screws right there on the receptacle. So I'm gonna go ahead and touch it right there. And as you can see, the tip is hot and this is counts as hot, which is kind of suspicious. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and test, test this out real quick for the sake of this video and uh, put my life on the line for you guys. No, I'm just kidding. Actually, it works. So as you can see, um, it totally is safe to use as this is still hot right there. Everything is good, safe to the touch. So anyways, it works. And I uh, just want to give you guys that example so uh, I can stand behind this and tell you that it works safely. So here's what it looks like when you put all your stuff into the carrying case. Um, as you can see, 
Um, the tips are protected by these little flaps. The other thing I would say that I don't like about this is the fact that when you fold it up, it kind of doesn't really work that well. Um, you got the flaps kind of interlapping over each other. That's kind of weird, but you just kind of wrap it up like a burrito and hope for the best. Um, so this is what it looks like. Um, the case is really nice, but the fact that it's kind of just weird when it folds up kind of bothers me, but um, the tips definitely aren't going anywhere. They are in there very tight. As you can see, I'm pulling on it very tough to get out. Um, but other than that, um, I think everything about this is great. Just the fact that when you go to fold this up, it's kind of whack a little bit. But other than that, I think it's really great product. And uh, if you're interested in this, definitely check it out. Either the two in one, which would be cheaper if you just want the Phillips and the flat blade, or if you want all eight of these, go ahead and get this one for an extra 30 bucks. Anyways, guys, that's going to do it for today's video. Hopefully you enjoyed. As always, if you did, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe. I'd love to see you guys back in the next video. I appreciate the support as always. And check the description for anything else and hit the notification bell to be notified when I upload new live streams. Thanks, guys. God bless. Peace.